Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Alpha Wisdom, I'm Misty Cassandria, and this is Lesson 116. Now, we're talking about the heart line still, and we're going to be talking about it more and more periodically. But today we're looking at two strong lines, the heart line and the head line. And what happens if there's something going on where there's the need for one to overpower the other. Okay, let's get started. Okay, now we're looking at the heart line, which is above. Here's the heart line. Here's the head line. And here, of course, is the life line. Now, what it says over here, the heart line falls toward the headline. What's going on here? These, incidentally, these are not uncommon. That is, they're not rare. These are common. Some, in some cases, very, very common. So if you don't see it in one hand, keep looking. You may spot it in another one. But the lesson is to help you understand what's going on with the person as far as the emotion and feeling and how is it affected or maybe affecting how you think, your reason, your logic, okay? So in this example, we see that the heart line falls. It seems to be inclined to fall toward the head line. Now we're accustomed to seeing it going up here, as I said. It can go up to this point, up to this point, or up to this point but it usually goes up. Here, this is going down, so it calls your attention to try to determine why this is happening. This shows the headline to be powerfully in the lead, and that when it comes to a choice between sentiment and reason, the heart will be second best. And once it takes control here, the control stays. It's not like if you do a timeline on here and say, well, when they got to be this point in life, then they start to do that. No. Once it's in, think of it as territory, head, headline territory, it's going to be affected. Okay? So this person, someone with this hand, would have more reasoning and logic instead of emotion and feeling. They're there, but they, they're like, it says, second best. Okay? I hope that's clear. Let's go on to the next example. Here we have still the heart line here. Here's the head line. And here is the information. The heart line starts from the head line. Yes. Sometimes we see this. The heart line is starting here. Now, this is his normal heart. So this says that, gee, this headline is really taking over. It shows that the headline has complete control over the heart line and dominates it. Well, here it is here. It's connected to thinking or so close. There is a connection. So naturally, thinking will be important with the person that has this palm. And it overshadows the meaning of this. Remember the heart line? Feeling and emotion. So they may come across as being very cold, and it's like they don't have any feelings. Well, if you're an understanding person, you can probably say, well... It's not their fault. Blame it on the connection between the heart and the head line. Okay? But we do see that. Okay? And as it is marked, you can be assured that the head line will be deeper and clearer than the heart line. That is, this will be a little more well-defined as compared to this. This will be a little thinner. It's like it just took over. It didn't have enough fortitude or strength to hold its own. 
Okay, this will be a continuous struggle between the two of these lines for who will be in charge or what's going to happen. But the chances in favor the headline because of the connection here. And you may wonder, can that change? No, I don't think so. The person can be aware of it and helped with suggestions to try to be a little more emotional, try to have a little more understanding, a little more feelings, things like that. So other than that, uh, that's about it. That's about it. Okay, let's take the last example. Now, of course, as a reminder, this is the heart line, this is the headline, this is the lifeline. This says the headline takes control of the heart line. All right, now the heart line, looking at this, starts here, it's going up, but all of a sudden it just dips down and touches the headline. What's going on? Okay, this says that the headline obtain control of the heart line and can be read from the point where the heart line starts. The control is here, but it can go all the way over to here. So this is similar to this. It's just another example of it. They may look a little different but it's basically the same in meaning, okay? Here, it starts here and goes across, like another uh, headline. Here, it starts in its home territory, and for some reason, it drops and touches the headline. And just for information, this principle applies to all lines that go into the territory or the area of another line. If that's the case, then where they went will be in control or the stronger of the two. Okay? All right. This ends our lesson for today. I hope everything was clear. And if you liked it or you understood it, by all means, give a thumbs up, share, and of course, subscribe. Well, thank you for watching the channel. Have a wonderful day, and of course, be happy. Bye.